Hello everyone, it's Chris once again with Ready to Roll Gaming. Today, Sunday, January 10th, day 10 of our Crack a Pack year long challenge. Today, we have Zendikar Rising, Pack One, Pick One. Here we go. I know we've been doing a lot of these, but gotta get through the box some point. Um, later on this week, I'm thinking about doing a uh, sealed, a little bit longer form video. Open six packs, try to make a sealed deck out of it. Um, but that'll be later on this week. But today, classic pack one, pick one, Zendikar Rising. Here we go. I hope everyone is doing fantastic today. It is cold here in north central Florida. Uh, staying warm, staying inside. But here we go. Our first pick is the Seafloor Stalker. And we will move on once we get into view. Perfect. Resolute Strike. The Electromancer. Gnarl Colony. Good old sk <laughs> Skeeter Sneak. The Living Tempest. Come on. Come on. Change some stuff on here. There we go. Yes. All right. Back into Turn Timber Cleric. Cleansing Wildfire. The good old 1 4 Elf Rogue Reach Snarcaster. Deadly Alliance. Mosh Pit Skeleton. Mine Carver. Sogmad Treasury. And. The good old world sculptor. Okay, um, it seems like the past three days have just been uh, green cards galore. I think Friday we had Turn Timber, Symbiosis. Yesterday we had the Ancient Green Warden. And here we have um, with the world sculptor. Sculptor, I'm sorry. Uh, so kind of similar to the Avenger, or um, gosh, what is that? Uh, original Zendikar. Uh, it is similar to this. Uh, that escapes me, but um, whenever the World Sculptor enters the battlefield, create a 0-1 green plant creature token for each basic land you control. Then landfall whenever a land enters your battlefield under your control. Put 4 plus 1 plus 1 counters on target plant you control. Uh, yeah. This might be, this might be the pick. It, it's just... It immediately changes the board state when you enter, or it enters the battlefield. And every turn you have a land um, going forward, it, it's just going to grow those plants. Um, again, not like the old version, or what the similar version was. I think it's Avenger and then the car. That's probably completely wrong. If you do know, please let, let me know down in the uh, comments. Or comments. Um, I mean, what... At worst, this enters the battlefield. If it's killed immediately, it could what make four, five, six block, you know, zero one blockers for you. Um, things to note, though, for sure, is the Mad Song Treasury, uh, one of the double flip lands or double face cards, land on the back, spell on the front. Um, other, all in all, there's really not much else that we would even consider first picking. Um, nothing, or I would say nothing that we're excited the first pick, other than the Deadly Alliance. Um, de destroy target creature or planeswalker instant, cost one less for each uh, member in your party. But yeah, um, <laughs> three days in a row, three green, rare, mythic rares uh, as our pick. But it's definitely going to be the World Sculptor. Again, immediately changes the board state when it enters the battlefield needs to be addressed right away by your opponent. If it's not, well, they're not going to have a very fun time going forward. And every turn you have a land going forward, it just gets better. Um, Red-green is a combination I would love to be in, uh, in a draft, especially starting out pack one, pick one. Um, but yeah, as always, guys, down in the comment section below, if you'd like to let me know what you would be picking in this pack one, pick one. For this one, I think it's pretty... Uh, clear what we're picking just because the power level is so much lower uh, compared to the two or three cards that we talked about. 
But as always as well, if you could like, comment, subscribe, let me know how you're all doing. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Thanks, guys.